right, so sorry for the shakiness, holding this by hand. But I've only had one cup of coffee, so it shouldn't be terrible. Um, index cutting in the Plasma Cam software. Get the full screen in here. You have to you go into your settings, up in settings, and uh, then you go to yeah, and your machine control, and then down here viewing indexing. You have to change your cut area to 4x8 by, by just toggling up or down, whatever you have to do. So then, now I've got a 4x8 and it automatically splits it into two 4x4s. So you draw your lines in there and when you do your cut paths it automatically says, hey do you want to separate these? And it's like, yeah, you kind of have to. So anyways, you do that. And then, I believe you can just select like these three. One, two, three. Do your your cut preview, and uh, so then it's just going to cut the one sheet first. And then after that, I will move the sheet um, 48 inches down, I believe, yep. And then pick these ones on top and cut those. So the real key is being able to precisely move your sheet, you know, the 48 inches that you have to do. All right, so real quick again is that it's going to cut from the bottom zero zero or whatever down in that corner and then cut 48 inches up and then I'm going to have to move from this cut point. I'm going to have to position it at my X zero. That's the whole idea anyway. Now what I'm going to do is measure from down in here, let's see if we can, uh, I'm going to measure from the inside of this rail because I can always pick it up further in here, which you guys can't really see, to where my sheet really is. I mean, I'm five and seven eighths here, and five and seven eighths down on this end also. So when I'm moving my sheet, really I just have to keep it to parallel to my Y axis, because that's the direction we're moving it more or less. And then, from this spot that I just measured, we'll call this a datum more or less, from this datum, I'm going to have to measure five and seven eighths inches to where I put that cut line, where that cut line ends. Like I said, the idea here is we got to make sure and get where this ended 
at five and seven eighths. Having moved it, you can see, I mean, very, very minute. It's a difference on my Y. Uh, that, I mean, that, what you're looking at is possibly just from it hesitating for a pierce point. So, I mean, this one's. Right, right here in the middle piece. So, and then uh, on the end over there, it's right there. So overall, I think it went really well, especially for, uh, I've never done it, but uh, I just felt like I'd make, I mean, for me never doing this, this is a first time indexing, I mean, straight lines, so I figured it would be easier, but there's, there's hope for everybody out there. I know there's a lot of questions on how to index with these plasma cams, so there you go. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments or just comments, you can leave them there too. Like it, share it, do whatever you would. I just hope that uh, we've all learned something from doing this. So I could have just as easily cut this out by hand just as well and but I figured I'd make a video for you guys. So thanks for watching.